fucking fuck? Transformers came first in Japan. Oh, who gives a fuck? Rich. Rich. I did check out for Family Fun Time. Is this game still as boring as it was an hour ago? I'm rather enjoying this game. <laughs> Let Jack enjoy his game, people. I'm enjoying it. I, I could see how it might be boring to you. Um, something... Uh... Look, the only things you like are FTL <laughs> and FTL. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So what's the problem? So why aren't we playing FTL? Something actually that I've just noticed that I think is very, very strange is there's no soundtrack. Hmm. There's no music to this game. And I find that to be very strange. Oh. Hunt Warbler. Shit. There's no soundtrack to this game. This game desperately needs a soundtrack. Mm hmm Desperately. XCOM 2. Now, people complained about XCOM 2. What there were mean? some. Playing XCOM 2. As far as games, they we, like uh, We street. played that a lot. That's true. Right in a row. And um, no, but you know what? That That's what we were playing. Rich really liked it. That's what we were playing. And I liked that that's what we were playing because we were also, you know, doing it for the show. Which ended up not happening. But, you know, okay. you get you get it. I mean, I could stream Dead Rising, but really, after my perfect no death run, there's nowhere to go but down. <laughs> That's true. It's really true. Ow. Ow. I'm just wondering if I can parry a ghost. Well, he killed me. But. So this game is basically Dark Souls combined with uh, Metroidvania. Absolutely. Absolutely. That's exactly what it is. And beyond the in incredibly and ridiculously ugly art style it's it's i mean it's all dark souls isn't isn't dark souls already metroidvania though what do you mean isn't dark souls metroidvania style game i i believe the implication with metroidvania is it's a 2d size yeah? yeah metroidvania has to be 2d i i would assume so okay as the original metroid and castlevania games are 2d side scrollers uh, I don't, I mean, I don't know if it ha if they have to be. I've, I've never done the research, but. Ah, dog. I guess, you know, what Rich is trying to make a clarification on is, is what is Metroidvania? Mm -hmm. That's just weird to call it the... Dark Souls slash Metroidvania inspired when if Dark Souls is already Metroidvania, because then it's just Dark Souls inspired. As semantics? A little semantics, but I, I think that's an important... It's an important semantic. I, I, I'm going to say, though, that in order to be a Metroidvania game, mm -hmm. you need to be a 2D side scroll. I, I will disagree. I think I'll disagree. Yeah. But it's whatever. It's semantics. Well, because the, the real idea of the Metroidvania games is exploration. Yeah, and, like, like Bloodborne. And opening up new paths with new equipment. Right? That's a big Metroid. Well, that's a Metroid thing. Maybe not a Castlevania thing. Castlevania is about just leveling up. Mm -hmm. Like Bloodborne. <laughs> <laughs> No, I like the semantics. I like this. I'm trying to give you an answer, and I don't know if I have a oh, fuck. I saw. I knew. I knew. I remembered. Dark Souls meets Guacamole. Ooh. Who said that? Who said that? I like to credit that. I don't. Know. Oh, like you didn't. Horrible say you... eyes sometimes have trouble reading, like colorful, like, like like light green font. A big. Big Fat Man 873 is what that looks like to my eyes, but I could easily be wrong. It's light green and white. And you know what, Rich? I, I was ready to give you credit on that. I thought that yeah, was no, good. no. I, I, don't, I, don't, I don't like taking credit for other people's shit. That's just yeah. wrong. <laughs> this 
Castlevania basically 2D Dark Souls? No, no. I mean, you know, Dark Souls, I think the Dark so the Souls born blood games have this very specific dodge roll counter mechanic All right. in their fighting, right? Some, and that is something that Metroidvania games don't have. Dodge roll and counter. Look at that. Look at that ugly ass counter animation. Look at how ugly his face is. Rich, look at how ugly his head is. You picked that face! Look at You it. you did that! Yeah. You did that thing! That uh, thing is you! Rich, ready? Ready? I'm gonna go get him. What I wanna know get. is I'm gonna go get him. <laughs> if you had picked the lizard person, yeah. would all the other people you run into, would they be lizard people? Ooh, I wonder too. Yeah. That's a that's a fair question, Rich. How am I going? What am I doing? Oh yeah. Do I have any new subs or new uh, uh, donations? Possibly. <laughs> Not Superman Jack. I don't have X-ray vision. I don't have X-ray vision and the desire to crush a human skull. <laughs> uh, oh, that's right. Actually, yeah, we have a bunch more. I just forgot to keep reading them. <laughs> um, what did you hate until you actually tried it? Spinach. Spinach, interesting. Yeah, love spinach. Spinach is good. Spinach is great. I used to think gyros were weird. You had one. Yeah. Gyros. You also pronounce it gyros. That's the proper way. Huh? It's the proper way, Euro. 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 How do you say it? Euro. Euro, yeah. Euro. It sounds like you're saying it different than I'm saying it. How do you think I'm saying it? Euro. 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 Like e No, it's not a it's not it's not a European currency. I know it's supposed to be gyro. No, that's not how it's supposed to be. They come from the same root word. Alton Brown did a whole thing on it. Yeah? Yeah. Because it comes from a meat that spins. I know at, at the gyro place I, I ate at, yeah. the, the foreign people behind the counter corrected me. They said it was gyro. Gyro. When I tried to order a gyro. It's not a gyro. I know that. Fine, well, they told me, though, it was gyro. Jack, I'm wrong? Gyro. Oh, I like gyro. <laughs> it's gyros because it spins on the stake. That's right. That's right. That's that's according to Alton Brown. It's supposed to be called a uh, a like you know a gyro, a gyro. But I don't know. They wanted to call something different for some reason. I don't know why. I'm going to remember this trap this time. Here's a trap. I love smushing things with my mace. Smush, smush, smush with my mace. I think XCOM. The classic XCOM is a game I would have poo-pooed before I actually played it. Turn Bay, that sounds boring. And I played it. All right, that's interesting. Like I said, I didn't play that for years until the controversy about the, the reboot. I think that's really interesting. Like, I remember seeing the ads for it when I was younger. I think they had, they had ads in, like, the Sci-Fi Channel for XCOM. Like, eh, eh. Didn't look interesting, eh? <laughs> that and Master of Orion. I think they advertise both. Sure. Boom. Just 
counter system is fucking awesome for when you deal with those types of enemies. Gotta love Rich and Jack setting themselves up for our internet ridicule. Keep it wrong, guys, but also keep it classy. It's just Pizza Train 11. That, that's what we're doing. We're here for. We're here to keep everything classy. Look, I don't know what you're talking about because I'm saying you real right. <laughs> How can we fix this? How can we find out the truth? A Greek man told me to call it a euro, <laughs> so I'm gonna call it a euro. <laughs> I mean, you know, that's, that's, that, I think that's fair. The foreign man told me to spell it like this. I'm going to trust the foreign man because it's a foreign food. Ooh, Dino Spinetti. Rich, what did you name your farm on Stardew Valley? Ah, oh, okay. What do you think I named my farm? Um... Oh... What would you name your farm? That's a good question. That's a good question. Chat, what do you think I named my farm in Stardew Valley? What do you name yours? Uh, because I was recording gameplay footage, I just named it Pre-Rec Farms. Okay. I named my farm Harvest Moon. Harvest Moon Farm. <laughs> oh, that's adorable. <laughs> That is adorable, Rich. And because I was playing Stardew uh, Valley, it wasn't redundant. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. It's adorable. And again, they got big. They got big at Ford, Rich. Yeah. That's what I got. Is that a mega spatula? A mega spatula. I got a big at Ford that I can't use. <sighs> and I don't know why I can't use it, but it doesn't matter because I got my fucking big ass mace trap. I see that trap. I'm prepared for that trap. Fucking hell. Fucking hell, game. Get it together. Oh. Okay, that's neat. Uh, so yeah, I'm, I'm pre-rec farms. And I don't, neither Rich or I, in time for it, we, we were hoping to get at least a full year in mm -hmm. before the review. But both of us well, are in late winter. Yeah. So it, uh, enough, I know, I'm, I'm about 30 hours into it. How far have you hour-wise? Like, like close to 40, 35. Okay. Somewhere in that range, 35 or 40. Okay. Figuring this game out. Does the farm game have an ending? No. I don't believe it does. Just one of those go to go to you good. Go to you good, man. You do you. I kind of want to update my pan, but it's just 
grossly, grossly underpowered now compared to my mace. Fuck yeah. Flames your mace one. Fuck yeah. Can I upgrade it again? Fuck yeah, I can. Ah, oh, so much. Ah, oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> forge it, baby. Fucking forge it. Yeah, it has a special event in year three that's effectively the end. Yeah, but I don't think you have to stop playing, though. I don't, I, yeah, I mean, I just don't know. I just don't know. And yeah, I saw the shrine thing. I got what they were. I got where they were going with that. But... I know what you're talking about the shrine thing. I saw it. <laughs> I know. I'm hip. hip and I'm down and I speak the lingo. I speak the lingo of the kids, Rich. Mm -hmm. Rich doesn't like farming and games, but he likes Harvest Moon? What? Do you mean grinding? Because no, I don't like grinding slowing down an action game. But when I'm playing a farming game, yes, I literally like farming, which isn't <laughs> the same thing as like... <laughs> Maybe what are you talking wait. about? It's quite possible, Rich, that they were being funny. Okay. Because if not, that would be incredibly silly. It's uh, I'm go I'm going to assume. Fuck! 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 I'm I'm never surprised though. I mean, I've heard some fucked up shit. In my time. Uh-huh. I mean... I'm going to assume that was them being funny. Yeah. Uh, only because I want to believe in the best of people. Fuck, 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 fuck. Get off me, dick. Dick, 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 dick! What? Not now, Rich. Off, off. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh yeah, for anyone who didn't see, um, the the new half in the bag is out. Half in the bag, Manus Manus of Steel, is out. You should you should go watch it. The little bit I saw seemed very fun. I'm excited to watch more. Oh, that's not bad. Yeah, that's what you that's what you do when you stagger and or like uh, if you uh, dodge, if you uh, mm -hmm. what uh, what do you call that? Repost. Rep if you repost correctly, you can do that and just murder them. And the family. Murder them and the family. I don't know what hit them. All that, all yeah. that, all that fun stuff. The, the, the lamentations of the women. You get it all. And oh god, another light green name on a white background. Was it the Master Two Thousand? What does that say, Jack? Rich, the, the did Master you really 20, record the entire film? The stuff was gold. Yeah, we really record me. We we snuck we no we we snuck in a little tiny recorder in my jacket pocket, with a, with a little mic coming out of here, loft mic. I think that's hilarious. But it wasn't nonstop laughter. I mean, obviously they only used the stuff where I chuckled. Right. Most of the movie is quite dour. <laughs> <laughs> to the point where there'd be no point in releasing the full footage of it. It's not like it's not like the movie has a laugh track. A few times. Is 
Is it any recording device illegal? I don't know about illegal. I don't think you can throw you in jail for that. They'll probably be willing to throw you out of a theater. Um, it's, it's illegal. I wonder if an audio recording device is illegal. In a theater? How would that be illegal, so it, technically? It, it's really just illegal to try to sell a bootleg copy. And that's totally not what we're doing with right. it, so... Yeah, yeah, I think you're in the clear. Makes me happy. <laughs> I like splattering. I like all the blood. Fan. Look at that. It's fucked up right there. Ooh, gold. This Jack sure is having fun. I am. I'm glad I'm happy for that. I am. I'm enjoying myself. I think this is a, this is a neat, neat old game. I'm dying a lot, but you know that's what happens. I'm getting a little fatigued. We're also getting a little late, and so you know I'm probably not going to make it too much further. Uh, and I just wish I could uh, change um, what every person looks like. Try. Can you have multiple saves? I wonder. End game. Jack is jacked on Easter candy. I have not eaten any Easter candy, and I have a shit ton of Easter candy at my house. Rich, what if some technology you thought was a terrible idea would ended up being a smashing success? Twitter. I have no fucking idea what people get about Twitter, why they want to use Twitter, what they see in it. No idea. Yeah. It's just, but it, was it ex extreme narcissism? But what do you get out of following? It's uh, uh, information or entertainment. There's better places to get information. That is, I mean, that's not true. Like, in, in, Twitter is instant. Twitter is instant and updated. So this is a Facebook update, only there's not a character limit. Well, I guess it's different things. But fa Facebook is all cluttered. Twitter is getting all cluttered, too. Um... Oh man, more tips. I'm sorry everybody about missing all of your tips, by the way. Um, uh, Tired and Sad says, do you guys think Zack Snyder is capable of making a good movie if the script was also good? All of his films seem to have terrible scripts. 300 was all right. But is this the fault of the director? The, the, the 300's all right. Yeah, 300's all right. Even... There were some even like good parts of his Walking Dead or uh, the, 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 Thirty uh, Days? No. no. Uh, Dawn, Dawn of the Dead remake. Oh, was that, oh, who was who was Thirty Days of Night? Not Thirty Days of Night. What was the other zombie one? The, the zombie, the zombie one that didn't have zombies. The Rage Zombies. Six, six days and se the sixth day, seven seven days. What the fuck was that called? The um. Thirty days later. Twenty eight days. Twenty eight days later. Twenty eight days later. That was not. I'm thinking of. I'm thinking of. What was it thirty days in like, the vampire one? <laughs> I was getting crossed with it. So, so three hundred was all right, but it was that was style over substance. That was like the one. The story was so simple. What's the story of the three hundred? These dudes beat up the other dudes. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, and so it was his style that carried. Yes. That very very simple script, and even his Dawn of the Dead remake, which I didn't fully care for, it had some neat ideas. I never saw it because I hate fast zombies. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. Um, so I, I do believe he is capable of making a good movie. I, I, and I don't know what, it is, what his thing is. He, he's, 
he's so into the studio system that he just can't he just can't I would like to see him make a Batman movie with Ben Affleck yeah with a different writer mm-hmm. I would like to see that I would give that a chance I would give that a serious chance I believe you can have multiple saves. And so you want to see what happens if we... Uh... Uh, Chad, I did not like Return to the Living Dead. Ew. All of these. Just look at how ugly this person is. Oh, we walk. Yes. Oh, I'm totally going to make Storm. I thought we were going with an entirely different yeah. skin type here. Well, well, then you choose where they're from. Oh! Yeah, and then we get this. Oh, that's interesting. I don't, I don't hate this character design. I know you do. You don't? It's fine. Rich, don't be gross. So wait, are we going a little different or are we going like full different? Full different. Okay. Here we go. We're making, we're making a... Green or charcoal? Charcoal. More lock storm. Pupper? You're going to be a pupper? Or a hunter? Whatever you want. Or a hunter. I don't want to be a hunter because then I don't get to see her awesome haircut. A knight? Ooh, I kind of like hunter. Oh, hunter, you get a whip. Yeah, we'll give hunter a try. Hunter. But the chef kicking ass. So right now, we're just trying to see if the other people look like different. If you pick a different looking character. Oh, yeah, and, and I get to keep the chef save. Yeah. I, it looked like there were multiple save slots. And so ba- all, we're, all we're wondering is if we choose a different race, everyone is that race. Which I think is a fair question. Should make that character in another account so you guys can co you can co-op? And now that I know what's up with the game. That look at that. Rich, did you know that one of the animators from the Batman from Batman the Animated Series storyboarded the Batman action scenes? Other other than the Superman fight, which is comical. I actually like the Batman action scene, so that, that makes sense. Is it Bruce Tim? Hey. Alright, so are they? Or are they just... I don't know, everyone's wearing a mask right now. Yeah. It looks like all of the pirates here... ...are, uh... Wait, 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 is Jack Man playing the, is Jack playing the game again? We're, we're testing a theory. We're just testing a theory. Settle down. Settle everybody. down. Settle down. Rich has a theory about people's skin color in the game. And it's a theory that we would like to test. Why'd you phrase it that way? Why why would you theory about people's skin color? Because that's the correct way to... Yeah. Oh, look, a Cthulhu monster. That's fun. So this is the fight we were supposed to lose, not to the pirates earlier. 
Okay, so now, like, is anyone else, like, a horrible monster like the person we are, is the question. Because we have, like, sharp teeth. Uh, no. Not a horrible monster? He has a beard. It's hard to tell. Oh. Oh, I, I did something. Yep, I did that. Okay, get out of here. Are there games that you stop playing because the art was so bad? I don't know if there are games I stopped playing because the art was so bad. There are games I never played at all <laughs> because the art style was so bad. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I initially, like, I stayed away from Spelunky for a long time because the art looked, like, weird and cartoony. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, that's not going to be a game I want to play. Uh, as it turns out, it was, you know, it's one of my favorite games. And so I, I've learned my lesson because of games like Spelunky and uh, what was the other game that I was uh, playing recently? Um, oh, motherfucker. Uh, I, I played on stream a couple times where you steal stuff. Oh! You're, you're, you're a thief. You're yeah, a yeah. The something? The, the Swindle. The Swindle. The Swindle also has a really janky art style. Um, but I enjoyed the game a lot. So... I, this art style I, I really dislike, but I'm not I'm not ready to just you know call it off. I I think. Oh wait, do I have? Oh no, I don't have anything to. I think everybody's just normal. I think this is just me. This skin color thing. I need an artifact. The artifact is what uh is what brings the people is what brings all the all the boys to the yard. <laughs> so I think thief. At the time thief came out, it looked acceptable. Uh, and actually, I think I think the fact that Thief uses lots of darkness just by you know its nature that, that gave it a lot of the, the, uh, longevity to the graphics, a lot of a lot of acceptability to the blockiness <laughs> when when everything is so fucking dark. I don't know. What if they just couldn't see it? <laughs> I think at the time it came out, it was just a little little bit substandard. Oh, was it? No, it looked good for its time, especially especially because of the use of dark. A lot of good use of color and darkness. In the mm -hmm. Like the character models, like they didn't even have noses. Oh, really? Well, I mean, it's really old. No people hanging, by the way, this time. There are people hanging up here. Hmm. I need to just quickly find an artifact, which I think is near the beginning. This game needs like a really silly tuba noise when you die. Thief mix up for models in environment and sound. Very much so. <laughs> very, very much so. Like, it's not even a recent thing. There was a thief mod that I used mm -hmm. that uh, replaced the character models in the first game with character models from the second game. So you could play Thief 1 with people who actually had noses. <laughs> it, wasn't a, it wasn't a huge improvement. <laughs> uh, no. So here's the, here's the answer. If you're a horrible monster person, 
the people in the game okay. remain the same. Okay. Also possibly racist. All right, great, I'm done. All right. I'm done. I haven't been standing up. I'm sure I'm going to stand up in a moment and feel a little bit like garbage. Mm -hmm. Let's go uh, Let's go through our tips if we have any. Hey, we got some. Um, have you guys watched Pee Wee's Big Holiday? It's pretty sweet, but definitely makes... Uh, but definitely misses Danny Elfman's score. The the Netflix original Pee Wee Herman movie. I didn't because it looked like it had a high potential to just be like sad. No. Oh. Just depressing and sad. Like, oh, uh -huh. this, is, this is what it's come to. I've heard good things. Yeah? Jay really liked it. Okay. If, if, I, if I remember correctly, I remember Jay tweeting positive things. I, it, it, looked like, it looked like a high potential for... Oh, Pee Wee just looks so old, and this is just not working. It's it's a desperate attempt to recapture something that's gone, and oh, it makes me cry. <laughs> that's what I thought I was gonna get with the sure. Tim, uh, with the, the Pee Wee Herman movie. Yeah. So the big holiday. Yeah, and I just haven't got around to it only because I'm still trying to fucking catch up on Daredevil and everything, and everything. So now if I hit continue, I should. My game should be there. Yes. Okay. Great. Lately, a lot of my free time's just been um, Stardew Valley. Right, yeah. exactly. I'll, we also had a game to play. Um, People ask why I don't play this or that or watch this or that. So sometimes it's things you gotta do and yeah. so many things. So many things. So many, there's so many things. Mr. Glitch! Hey guys, I humbly suggest Star Control 2 for a future stream. It's full of opportunities for your delightful voice acting, skills to shine, and it's free, you fucks. Star Control 2. I will add it to the list, Mr. Glitch. Tired and Sad says, if the DC movie universe's misguided tone and direction are the, its biggest problem. Misguided yes. tone and direction. Yes. Yes. The problem is they're trying to make everything Batman. Yes. Not, and and like not only everything Batman, but they're also like front-loading this movie. With every Wonder Woman in the flat, everything's in the movie. Oh my god! And I think that's just flat out contradiction when it comes to Superman. Mm -hmm. He's portrayed in uh, like a grim, horrible, murderous way. Yet, parts of, sometimes the script still wants to act like he's a virtuous hero that we're supposed to root for. When you don't get that from watching the movie at all, like at all. No, that never comes across. Um. What would be, so, so to finish the question, Tyron said, what would be your biggest criticism of the Marvel Cinematic Universe films in general? I, you know what Tyron said? That is a good question. That is a good question. As a, as a universe, it's fine. It actually, it, it's, a, it's a cohesive, functional universe. I don't have any criticisms, criticisms of the universe, yet I've been like lukewarm or not into a lot of the movies that have come out for it. Mm -hmm. I mean, you can call us a Marvel fanboy, but, you know, say, I loved Iron Man 1. Uh -huh. Iron Man 2 is, eh. I, I, I actually do love Iron Man 3. As you Captain should. America 1, I hated. You hated? I hated Captain America 1. It was, the movie has no idea w what it's doing in the second half. It has a great origin, and then, ah, now he's gonna punch a uh, Red Skull in the face, and then they crash. I don't know. A terrible ending. Yeah, Thor. Both Thors. Yeah. I, I actually I didn't even bother to see the second one. <laughs> well, there Because I'm such a Marvel fanboy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you are. You know that about you. The Avengers was great fun. Mm -hmm. The first Avengers, mm -hmm. great fun. The second one, eh. Yeah. So it's not like it's not like I'm sucking the Marvel Cinematic Universe's cock here. But it is what it needs to be. Mm -hmm. The, uh, you know, I think the the fault, the problem with the Marvel Cinematic Universe is the same reason why they're successful, which is it's a it's a heavily producer driven universe, mm -hmm. right? Like Marvel has control over everything, and that's everything from Agents of Shield to Daredevil to Jessica Jones to Captain America. Everything. They have final say on everything. You know why that's appropriate? Huh. The Marvel Universe 
uh-huh. was always at its best when there was a strong editor behind it. Mm-hmm. The Jim Shooter years were fucking great. Mm-hmm. And then the years when they had editor in chief by committee, oh, everything was terrible. Yes. And so they have a strong vision for their universe, but I think that also hurts them. You look at something like Ant Man, which is a pretty subpar movie. Haven't even seen it. There you go. Like, and, and, I, and I like Paul Rudd. And a, a lot of the action sequences were really cool in Ant Man, but overall pretty subpar. That's be- and it's because they were like lunging forward after a strong director left, and you know they replace him with an all right director, and it's it's an all right movie. But I think like their biggest strength is also their biggest weakness, which is not to say it's a huge weakness. Like they've created a cohesive universe, but I think they can s- that steamrolls some of the creativity okay. that could exist. Okay. If that makes any sense. Yeah, no, that makes sense. I would have loved to see an Edgar Wright Ant-Man. <laughs> that would have been a fun time. It, yeah, but it might not tonally fit in but with the universe not. plants. Exactly. It wouldn't tonally fit in. That's yeah. why he didn't do it. Yeah. <laughs> you know. And so that is my biggest criticism. But, I mean, I, I, overall, I like it. I like the universe. It's fun. I thought it was subpar. I want to rewatch it. I want to rewatch Ant-Man because I only saw it once in the theater. Mm-hmm. And I want to give it a second try. Right now, you can't rent it digitally. You can only buy it. And I don't want to watch it again for 20 bucks. <laughs> that's that's my feeling on Ant-Man. I think, I think one of the biggest problems with the DC Grimdark plan is... While Grim and Dark might work for like a movie or a character, mm-hmm. that's gonna be a miserable fucking universe. Could you imagine? No, I can't. I don't Could want to. You imagine every fucking like the 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 reason the Flash TV show is so successful is because it's lighthearted. It's a guy running around. Like they joke around about like the characters' names. That's great, and th- that's what people want. Like, oh, you run around real fast. Let's have some fun with that. Let's have a let's have a flash movie where he's a miserable cunt. <laughs> oh, speed! Speed is the only way I can run away from my demons. I, the demons that haunt me. Are they going to call it the the DC Comics Cinematic Universe? Is it going to be the DCCCU? <laughs> Just let the spit take happen, Jack. No, you got Just it. let the spit I take happen. I was thinking happen. a big drink of water when Rick said that. <laughs> oh, that's great. <laughs> The DCCU. <laughs> that was great. Mm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I, I do. I wish our Marvel would have let Edgar Wright finish Ant-Man, but Edgar Wright wanted to do things that Marvel didn't want to do. It didn't fit in with their producer-driven direction. And th- they have the right to do that because they have the money. They, they paid Edgar Wright. <laughs> So, the, so they can tell him what to do. That's how it works. But he runs so fast that he smashes into a little boy and gore him across seven counties. Oh, that's, I have to live with that now. What kind of hero am I? Oh, I guess I'll run really fast again. <laughs> In any case, in any case, oy, 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 oy. we'll get you know what we'll get into more of this on Wednesday when we have our spoilerific yeah. conversation. Oh. Any any last minute uh, donations there? Uh, misguided tone of direction was our last. Okay. So. Okay, move it over to the big screen. Move it over to the big screen. Hey, well, almost. Oh I can see part of it. Oh my God. There we go. Save Dro! 18 months in a row. Fruit Pie, the magician. It's Fish Buzz! Yay. 15 months in a row. Sausage Toes. 15 months in a row. Mall Rat Call! 18 months in a row. Le Bill Le Hecka. 21. Fucking months in a row. 
pizza train. Oh, oh my God, you're doing the kiss at the end. I stepped over. I didn't know you were doing that. It's a spicy la echo. Oh God, it scrolled. We, we're gonna miss people. We need to scroll back up. Yeah, I know, I know. Pizza Train 11, 14 months in a row. Uh, collecting data, 13 months in a row. McCosnick! Hard Tree Fokker, welcome. Longshanks 1, 14 months in a row. One small ball. Frosty Snooze, 20 fucking months in a row. Spinet, 315. Welcome, Spinet, 315. Subscribes to Hack Frauds. You know what? I think at one point we were all just a goo baby. Goo, goo baby. <laughs> I like that one. A Michelle 87. I got it right this time. Nice. It's nice. It's great. Yeah. 19 months in a row. Loner Archon. 19 months in a row. KGB ate my bread. <laughs> that was good. Thank you. That was a good Russian, Rich. All Russian from now on. Space Camo. 19 months in a row. Comically small skeleton. <laughs> tiny, tiny man skeleton. Um, Ikatarzo. Gave 13. Oh, sorry. Oh I, my I, God. I wasn't reading correctly. Ikatarzo, 13 months in a row. Thank you. Gay for Jack. Yay! Someone's happy about me. Lando was taken 18 months in a row. Quinsomniac, 19 months in a row. Crocodile Brain, 17 months in a row. Moki B85, 21 fucking months in a row. Harry Fed, 14 months in a row. Is that Ephibonum? That's right, I like Ephibonum. Then we put it, we make a feminine popcorn. <laughs> A finamon! A finamon! A finamon! Is that what I say? A finamon! <laughs> we make a feminine top queen. A feminine. A feminine top queen. A feminine top queen. Um, <laughs> just remembering how much I enjoyed that last time. Dima Dove I. Wait. Dema Dove? Yes. Dema Dove I. 15 months in a row. Knowledge Junkie! Old. Beat. 16 months in a row. Old Pete. Way better than that Young Pete. He's a dickhead. Oh, fuck Young Pete. Young Pete's a, 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 a straight up dickhead. So energetic and cocky. With uh, make, make, making mistakes. It's like, it's like we're all tired, okay, Young Pete? Settle the fuck down. Old Pete just wants to die. Right, and we like that about him because he's a cock too. <laughs> <laughs> and <laughs> Star Harbles. I'm sorry, Star Harbles? Star Harbles. Oh, we got at least Star Harbles. <laughs> Thank you Clapping. for subscribing. It's true, we really do. A fifty a feminine. What? A feminine. A feminine? A cinnamon? Yeah, a feminine. Cinnamon toast crunch? Feminine toast crunch. <laughs> I don't know. You gotta hit the end button. I, oh, you don't on the. Now I gotta hit this end button. Oh wow! I gotta hit this end button, and then we have to hit stop broadcast. Oh my god!